Let's talk Minecraft. Hello everybody, my name is Edson and welcome. What you're watching right now is a brand new Saturday vlog and this week what I want to talk about is some Minecraft changes. Uh, now these are, well, there's a couple of them that I'm going to go into um, that have been sort of like hinted at or said that they've tested this thing out in Minecraft and whatnot. But none of these are confirmed to be changes in Minecraft. This is just what I would like to see in the game, what I think could be added into the game in the future that I think would help it and take it onto that next level. Now, the odds are most of these have already been discussed by the, by the people over at Mojo. And they are probably, some of them are already in the works and we just don't know anything about about them. Um, the topics that I'm talking about, like, so I've split it off into like five sections. I guarantee they've brought up many things within these topics anyway. So let's get into it. To start off with, the first lot of changes that I want to talk about is more ores. Um, now, I've sort of like been thinking about what extra ores, because they brought in emeralds uh, when they brought in the villagers. Or it might have been a little bit after they brought in the villagers. I can't exactly remember. But they brought in emeralds. They were the last ore that they actually brought in. Um, and since then, we haven't really seen any more ore. I would have liked to have seen some. Um, and the, the two that everyone say are ruby and sapphires. Because in all mod packs, you see rubies and sapphires as the two other main ores. Um, and they go... They sort of... When you see them in games or you see them in mob packs, it's like rubies, sapphires, and emeralds. They're the three, like, of those sorts of ores, if you get what I mean. Like, you, those three go together. So when they brought emeralds in, I was certain that they were going to bring ruby and sapphires in in, like, a couple more updates, but they never did. So I'd like to see those two in. Also, I would like to see tin and copper. And with that, I would like to see bronze, because tin and copper, like, in all mob packs, everything, they make bronze. Um, so tin, copper and bronze. Obviously bronze you can't mine. It's made from tin and copper. Um, so that'll be five ores. Ruby, sapphire, tin, copper and bronze. They're the five ores I'd like to see in Minecraft. I think they, they should be brought in. I think they might be brought in in the future. Um, and now we're going to move on to the next sort of like sort of thing that I want to see brought in. And that's more animals. Now, a lot of people say that they should put in more uh what's it mo creatures that's what it is no i i can 100 percent guarantee that the majority of the things within mo creatures will never be in minecraft um and there's a few reasons for that if you think of the actual animals not mobs that spawn at night the animals how many of them attack you just just out of a whim none right you have to actually be so I, I think you i think wolves do but you have to actually hit them first um they're the only ones that i think do now in mo creatures quite a lot of them just attack you just if they see you those ones never going to be in the game it just no it i can just never see them being in the game um quite a lot of people say sharks never going to be in the game because they attack you it's it's not going to be in the game if they just attack you out on, on the whim when it's daytime. It's just it's not going to happen. I can never see it happening. Um, and that's why I don't think Mo Creatures is something that quite a lot of people say, oh, they should add it into Minecraft. They really shouldn't. It's, it just becomes an animal game then. But with that being said, there's a few that I'd like to see. Now, the only ones that I've... Because I've, I looked through the Mo Creatures animals list. I looked through quite a few of the Mod Packs animals list. And I actually found quite a few... That I liked. Um, I, I don't know whether I'd want all of these in, but I could see these actually working in the game, and I'm going to go through them all. So to start off with, um, Panda. Now the reason I've started off with the Panda first is because Dinnerbone actually said that he did test a Panda in the game before, because it's like a useless mob, because pandas don't do anything, um, and it would be an also a good way to bring in another variation of reeds. Like you've got sugarcane at the minute, but you could then bring in with it bamboo, which sort of goes on to my crops later on. Um, but yeah, like you could then bring in bamboo with that, which could grow in jungles. You could it, it'd be there'd be a biome specific animal, but like pandas, jungles, it 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 just happened. Um, so yeah, panda, I think that would work. So it's not very like it's a useless mob, um, much like it's a useless animal in real life. Um, 
and I could actually see it be, being in Minecraft. Along with that, um, there's a few that there's turtle. I think a turtle could work in Minecraft. Um, I honestly think that they would do well in Minecraft. Um, I'm not too sure how rare they would be. I'm not sure if they would grow massive like they do in Mo Creatures, but I think they they would work well. Um, there's also a, a flying one. I would like to see eagles or birds of, of some sort. Just one sort of bird that flies around that maybe lands on trees or something that you could shoot and then you could get bird meat. Um, I would also like to see turkeys. Now, you've got chickens and stuff. I'd love to see turkeys in the game. Um, I'm not sure whether that would happen. Um, I'd also like to see deer. Because hunting deer, like you could, that I, I just think that would work. And like, obviously, if you got too close, they ran off. That would be good. Uh, rats, that would be something that I'd like to see underground. Like, if you had rats, um, you could then like put them in like the mine shafts and stuff that are running about as like an extra mob underground. Um, and then to top it off, and uh, there's two things I'd like to see in the water, and that is whales and dolphins. They're the two things I'd like to see. Not not sharks. I would not like to see sharks. Whales and dolphins don't attack you. I think whales would be a lot more... I think they'd be the odd one every now and then. Um, and these would obviously have to be in oceans. Um, and I think dolphins, you'd find them in packs or something. Like you do squids, but very less often. Um, and they're all the animals I would like to see in Minecraft. Or I think could actually work. I'm not sure that I'd want whether all of them would be in Minecraft. I guarantee not all of them are going to... Um, but I'd like to see a few of them because I think a few of them would actually work. Um, and now we're going to move on to the crops because I already started talking about that. I'd like to see bamboo in the game if we got pandas. Um, and and that would be like another sort of reed that we could grow. Um, and then also I would like to see bushes. So berry bushes. So like in mob packs you see uh, blueberries, blackberries, uh, raspberries, sort of like bushes. And you like hit them to get the berries off. I'd love to see that in Minecraft. I'd also like to see tomatoes. Um, you could use that. Uh, that could then go into another soup. Um, they could be something that you could... Uh, I'm not too sure whether you would... I don't think you'd be able to cook them. But it'd be something that could heal like two or something and you could get like loads of them. Because uh, it's just... I was trying to think of stuff that you could actually plant. Um, also, I'd like to see lemons and oranges as well as a better way to harvest apples. So maybe like specific trees that you could get to harvest these. I'd, I'd love to see lemons, oranges, um, as well as like a better solution to get apples in the game. That would be something I'd like. Um, as, as well as that, um, moving on to the sort of third thing that I've got, I'd, I'd like to see more random builds. Um, now, more random builds. There's a few that I've got ideas for, um, and that would be shipwrecks. So I would possibly like sort of like a biome change, so like the oceans in Minecraft, because they're, they're a lot more rare now to find like an open ocean. But when you find one, I'd like it to go quite deep, so like remove quite a bit of the underground, like the mines and stuff below, and have it go quite deep, and then like have like shipwrecks at the bottom or something with treasure. That'd be awesome. Um, because I think, uh, I think Dinnerbone actually did tweet or Jeb like they tweeted something about they 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 want to eventually, and they were experimenting with, um, like one-off items in the game that are named something that have got specific enchants. That could have like enchants that you can only you can't like get in these enchants yourself. You can only get them on like a one-off item. So that'd be a cool way to integrate those items into the game. Have like shipwrecks, have like buried treasure, um, like abandoned villages, or like uh, I don't know, like a, an, a a sort of a Mayan temple instead of like the jungle temples, and have these like really rare sort of like treasured sort of places that you can find what like like sort of like as rare as mushroom uh biomes are because they're like one in every ten thousand blocks possibly just one in every ten thousand blocks but the loot is awesome and i've like loads of traps loads of tnt traps stuff like that i just like to see that just like a one-off thing that you could potentially sometimes find that would be awesome um, and then to go on to the final thing i would like to see better npc villagers now is I'm going to read what I wrote down because um, it's in front of me here. Uh, so I've got different levels of villagers. So you have smaller villagers, then you have sort of like uh, which are like less evolved, um, and they're sort of like more common, like like you would find villagers now. But so you would find better slash more established villagers um, in 
I don't know, like it's very random. Like say, like the mushroom sort of islands, they're quite ran, like well, sort of quite rare. But you could find like a potential. Well, you could potentially find a village that is more evolved, more like a city or like a town, and it's got loads of builds, like loads of villages connected. It's got like a few extra buildings, like really rare buildings. They got even more loot, but they are really rare to find. That's what I'd like. Just like rather than like, because you see, you see villages now. You've got potatoes, carrots, and wheat. If you're lucky, sometimes you only get two of them. Um, you sometimes get a blacksmith and a library. Um, and and they are bringing in, like, more um, villager NPC, like, professions. So you see them in, like, uh, different outfits and stuff. I think they are working slowly towards this. Um, and it's something that I think would really work. So, like, have, like, uh, some more established villages um, that, that could be classed as towns or cities have them rarer to find and you have like better loot there and stuff like that um so yeah that's all that's all the things that i think should be in minecraft i know it is a bit like hitting them one after another what i think i'm going to do when i edit this i'm going to have like pictures of like uh, mods and stuff that have got these things that i've talked about just so you guys can see a more visual sort of representation of what i'm actually talking about and let me know do you guys like any of, the ideas, any of these ideas? If you do, let me know in the comment section below. Let me know which ones you really like. Let me know which ones you think might not be in or might be in the works. I don't know. Also, if there's anything that you guys would like to see in Minecraft, let me know in the comment section below. I'd love to talk to every single one of you about what you guys would like. Um, and possibly you give me some ideas of what I would like as well that I've just not never thought of that before. Um, so, yeah, let me know in the comment section below. Like the video if you enjoyed it. Also, like I say, comment, subscribe if you're new to the channel. And as always, I'll speak to you all soon. Take care.